Alright, um, hello guys, welcome to a new game I'm going to be playing, Pokemon Zeta. I have not made a video in a long time, for, for good reason. I have started college, and I've been really, really, really busy, and I really am busy. So I'm not sure about how often I'll be making these videos, but, I mean... Recently, I decided to get back into Pokemon. I've been away for like a long time. <laughs> I I don't know. Black and White really just did it for me. I didn't want to. I didn't like those games, so I just kind of stopped playing for a while. But you know, I couldn't be away forever, and I Munching Orange started playing this game, and I watched it, and I really liked this game, so. I decided I would give it a try. So, yeah, I'm going to play Pokemon Zeta. And this is the first time I've made a Let's Play video in a long time. I think the last time I made a video was like early summer when I was playing a hack I made, which wasn't very good. And I don't even know if I finished it. I don't think I finished it. I mean, I finished playing the game, but. I don't think I finished uploading the videos because I never got them all narrated, but at least for this I'm doing live narration, so I should be able to get them all narrated, otherwise you won't even, or I'll just quit, you know, I don't even know what'll happen, I'm busy. <laughs> so I've been, I've been gone for a really, really long time from making videos. It's not, I'm not happy about it. I really enjoy watching YouTube videos. I do it a lot. It's what I've been doing since I was in sixth grade. And when I was in sixth grade, I discovered a guy named Marilyn who made Pokemon Diamond videos, and that's what got me into Pokemon in the first place. And eventually, I just kept playing all the games, and then I got to Black and White, and I just did not like those games at all. I really did not like those games. I think I did beat the game at least on my own DS copy, but I really did not like the game, so I stopped playing. And I didn't... I lost all interest when Black and White 2 came out, and I was just like, I don't care, that's stupid. And then X and Y came out, and I was just like, gosh, you're just making a million Pokemon games, so stupid. Oh, it's in here. Now, I can't go that way, apparently. So, I just stopped. I, okay, the reason I thought X and Y were stupid was because... I didn't like how it was gimmicky with all the mega evolutions. I thought that was, I don't know, I didn't like that. And the way it looked, I like it being this simple. I like simple games. All the focus on graphics is just not my, not my style. So, instead of playing an actual new game, I decided I'd play, okay, apparently I have to walk this way. I decided I would play a hack that I really like that I just recently beat. So. Without any further ado, we are going to pick our team member. What's going on here? Okay, either Bellsprout, Magby, or Horsey. Oh boy. Um, very little thought has gone into this. <laughs> Let's see. I used a Horsey last time I played this game, and Kingdra is awesome. Munching Orange used a Magby, and it's not like we're close or anything. I've never really talked to the guy, but I do enjoy watching his videos, so I've seen Magby been, be used. Bellsprout is the one I've never seen be used. So, I'm going to use a Bellsprout. <laughs> I know it's kind of like the weakest, not the weakest, but the weirdest of the bunch. What should I name it? Oh gosh. Um, usually I don't name Pokemon, but because this is a hack, I'd figure I'd name it. And it's raining outside. I love it here in Ohio. Um, geez, what should I name you? I was about... I was about... Belly. <laughs> that's a dumb name, but that's his name. So I got Belly the Bell Sprout, which won't make much sense when it gets a little bigger, but whatever. Belly the Bell Sprout. Oh yeah, another thing about this game. The Pokemon follow you around, so... I have like a little bell sprout here. It's pumped and ready to go. Yeah, rocks. This thing's leaking water. All right, bell sprout is anxious. Ooh. So, this is Pokemon Zeta. It's like Heart Gold Soul Silver, where you get the people following you, the Pokemon following you, and there's lots of Pokemon running around in this game, not just your own. 
Hold one. Uh, I think there are a, at least, two that I know of fake Emon. Three, at least three fake Emon. I don't use them. I don't even think you can catch them. They're just kind of like, in like uh, rival battle, not rival, but like major battles. I guess you could say. I'm not gonna spoil when they come up, but there is three fake Emon. I don't. I like faking more. I like the idea of it, but the ones in this game are horrible. <laughs> they don't. They just look really stupid. One time, I tried making my own game, and it was just gonna be tons of faking on. And so I didn't make the sprites. I just went on like the internet and looked up tons of people that had made sprites. And I just kind of took the sprite, copied and pasted it, and I just filled up an entire game basically. But I moved away to go to college, so I never really got to finish it. <laughs> I mean, maybe this summer, if it's still on that computer, I'll finish it when I go home, but, you know, I'm across the country, and all that stuff was on that computer, so, it's a lot of work. I had over 100 Pokemon made. I don't really know if the, ha if the game would work, because sometimes when I try to do stuff like that, it just glitches out, but, I don't know, I, I think it'd work. I think it, I had, I, I, I had high hopes. And if it would have worked, I would have definitely, like, made a Let's Play of it. I shouldn't say that. I probably wouldn't have, but I would have liked to make a Let's Play of it. Want to fight again? Wait, you gave us Pokeballs? That's neat. I didn't even... I don't read things. <laughs> Running shoes. Heck to the yeah. All right. Um, let's see here. Toggle, toggle. There we go. Now we can automatically run all the time. Wonderful. Mudkip. I don't think he's that cute. I think Mudkips are not very good. Actually, yeah, they are. They're really good. I was thinking about making this a, like, a... What's it called? A Nuzlocke. But this is a really hard game. And I don't want to die. Now, honestly, the hardest part of this game is not the Elite Four. At least, for me, it wasn't. When I played this game, I had an incredibly difficult time with the gyms. It was the Elite Four that I swept through without a problem, so that was a little odd. I think I was just over-leveled, but... I don't know, I shouldn't have been able to do it so easily. So, this time through, I'm going to... Um, can I go this way? Apparently I can, but it doesn't matter, there's nothing up there. I have a feeling we're supposed to go in here. I'm not, I don't really remember. Oh, apparently you were. I don't remember this game exactly. I played it one time, so I'm not really an expert. Ah, it's been so long since I've made a video. It's so weird. I probably don't really have any followers. I know I have some subscribers. I honestly have no idea how many. What am I supposed to do? What did he say? I don't know what he said. I'm leaving. <laughs> I don't know what you said, dude. I'm just going to go start my adventure. I need to go to the Pogo School. Okay, apparently that's what I need to do. Oh, I don't know how many subscribers I have. Probably not very many, but I'm in, I'm looking to try to build that again. I want to get subscribers. That's my goal. So, you know, I don't know if I have a hundred. If I do, they're all ghosts, as in they don't watch anymore. But I'd like to get a hundred legit ones. So my goal is a hundred subscribers. Yeah, can I fight you? You want to fight? No, you don't want to fight. You want to fight? Okay, you're kind of mean. What about you? All right, you just you're just fun. Do you want to fight me? What do you mean you'll see me there? I'm I'm gonna beat you. When did, you didn't pass me. Everyone saw that. You did not go by me. And there he is. He is a magician or something like that. I don't even know. So, Professor Oak and Gary. I think that's his name. I actually don't know. I didn't get the name of him. I don't think. So he's going to pick probably a Magby. Yep, that's what I thought. <laughs> Magby, you suck. Okay, let's go fight him. Do I fight that guy? I honestly don't remember if I fight him. I don't really have any memory. Oh, yeah, you fight him. At least you fight him at the end of Victory Road. And I didn't play any of the post game on my first original playthrough of this, so you might fight him again after that. I don't really know. 
probably I'm willing to bet you fight him again so and I'm willing to bet that you have fought him before then so we're probably gonna fight him really soon I don't really know when our first trainer battle route 301 hoo hoo progression we got a guy named Aiden Aiden I'm gonna age you with a butt whooping <laughs> oh, I'm funny pound wormpole wormpole I like wormpoles definitely not gonna use a wormpole because this game's hard and I, I don't think a silicon or a dust ox would be very useful but whatever why is pound so weak come on belly you gotta be stronger than this you have such a big belly just kidding your belly is a twig literally <laughs> look at that high attack heck yeah Oh, this is um, not a hack of any game in particular, by the way. So I guess it really isn't a hack. It is its own game. This was made by the person who made the game, which I don't even know your name. So, yeah. He made two, Pokemon Zeta and Pokemon Omnicron. Not really sure of the difference. I almost died. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. If this was a Nuzlocke, I almost lost. Thankfully, this is not a Nuzlocke. <laughs> But, um, yeah, I don't know your name, so credit to, I'm sure you guys can look up videos, or look this up on Google or something. Why the heck is it keep going to bag? And you can figure out who made the who made this game yourself, so go ahead and use your internet. Zeta and Omnicron, they're pretty fun. The battles, I like how they look like hard gold, soul silver. And then you, but the sprites are like, the trainer sprites at least are all fire red leaf green. And then the overworld's like fire red leaf green. At least I think that's what it is. It might be emerald. I think I heard some people saying it's like emerald. I don't know. I think it looks like fire red leaf green. <laughs> and I know those games. I played a lot of those games. I probably should have healed. I, I want to catch something. I really want to at least get one more guy on my team. That's, that's what I want. Tell you what I want, what I really, really want. <laughs> belly. Pound the belly. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so, oh, oh, you got one more. It's gonna be a Caterpie. Oh, dang. I wonder if an Omnicron, there's Weedles. I don't really know. I don't even know. Caterpie is also a pretty weak Pokemon. In the beginning of the game, it's pretty good because it evolves really quickly, but I'm not one who you catches something just to use for a little bit. I don't like doing that. I feel like that's, like, unloving, which is weird, because this is a video game, and I have no, like, I just threw away all the Pokemon I just had before that I've spent, like, raising to, like, all of them into their mid-70s, so. I should be used to, what's this going to say? Zarevar Town is north, and Superior City is south. Well, I'm going to pause for a second and go heal. I wonder if this was where I was standing. I don't know. Um, I want to catch something. I really want to catch another Pokemon. So, I mean, I don't want it to be weak, and that's kind of what these ones are. If I can run into something. Okay, finally. It's a loud truck. <laughs> Someone's with their big truck. Yeah, I, I live in Ohio now, and there's a lot of farmers out here. So, lots of trucks. What is that noise? They just turned their truck on? To be loud? I don't know how much of this noise you guys are picking up, but it's pretty loud. They're not even leaving. Maybe it's a lawnmower. Give me, a, give me one second. Alright, I think I fixed the problem. I probably could have paused it while I did that. I'm such a bad person. Uh, I think I fixed the problem. It was, You know what it is? It's a, like, one of those things used to cut wood. Like, for branches and stuff. I don't know what they're called. But that's what it's doing. It's like a really big thing cutting up tree branches. And I don't know why they're doing that out there, but they're doing it. 
I don't want a Rattata or a friggin' Caterpie, so we're just gonna move on. You know what? This video is kind of long. After this video, after this fight, I think I'm gonna call it a part, and that'll be a pretty historic part because it's my first one. It's my first one in a long time. I don't know how long. It's been many a months. Poison Sting does nothing. Why am I using Vine Whip? This is a poison type. I'm a tard. By the way, I hate how Caterpies are poison types. That's just the most... Maybe they're not. Maybe they're just bug. At least, I don't know. A Caterpies poison type? They should be. I mean, they poison when you touch them. Whatever. Caterpie's dead. He probably has a Kakuna or something. Oh, maybe he's just got all three. Yeah, that makes sense. Just lots of pounding going on. Did I have a fourth attack? Do I? Oh, I have Stun Spore. Oh my gosh, let's use it. Just because I want to use it. Oh my gosh, yay, Stun Spore. Oh, that's another thing I should point out. The sprite, I mean the attack animations are very different in this game. I don't know why, but they're a lot simpler. Most of them are just brief things. Like, that doesn't look like Pound. It looks like a punch, but that's Pound, apparently. Yay, Pound. <laughs> Alright, last one's gonna be a Caterpie. How much you wanna bet? Oh, you all made money. Pound the Caterpie. It's gonna live. Oh, ooh, ooh. Two hit KO. I'm getting pretty good. Bellsprout, Uber, heck yeah. Good job, Belly. And Caterpie gains 47 experience. And that, my friends, is part one. So, comment, like, subscribe. I will see you all next time. Bye.